What up, everybody? It's your boy K Ray 06 back here on K Ray TV, and we are here for our episode preview. Yes, episode 15 All American just ended, so you know we gotta hop over and see what episode 16 is gonna be about. Title is No Op Left Behind. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny, considering that um, I use that word frequently in the reviews when I talk about Coop and Spencer. And uh, I really want to see what this this preview is going to show us. It's going to show us. All right, before we do, y'all already know what to do. If it's your first time here, then go ahead and hit that like as it helps the channel. YouTube sees the interaction. They push that thing forward. And if uh, you like what you see on the channel, you're happy that your boy is back and you want to join the best squad on the net, then show some love by hitting that sub. Click that naughty bell, hit all, and share like you care. All right? Woo, let's get into this thing, baby. Roll tape. Feel like I ain't said this in a while, but let's put these on so I can see better. Who? I'm having a Thanksgiving tournament. That sounds like a good time. Okay. The the they walked in together. Who and I ain't talking? So fix that. We don't want to move away and leave all these issues and bad blood. There's still one obstacle that you're running from. Mm. Ain't nobody running from Spencer. All right. take one of these out all right that was a uh, pretty short and sweet y'all pretty short and sweet no op left behind so you know how we do it in here we're gonna go ahead and do this rewind style and that's how this go frame by frame and talk about what uh what transpired all right let's go let's go and <laughs> as y'all can see here live Liv and Spencer come in together. I already know y'all out there, the Spolivia crew, y'all already geeking out. And uh, Liv looking good up in here. I know I'll be getting on her neck. And I know some of y'all like that. Y'all, do you even like her anymore? Yeah, you know, when she act ignorant, I gotta, I gotta tell her. But she, she looking, she looking right here. She looking right here. And they trying to walk in all conspicuous. <laughs> we know, we know what y'all doing. We know what y'all doing. And. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look, Carrie. What is Carrie doing there? It said Friendsgiving. Friendsgiving. Who friend is she? And what's she giving? Except for that lifetime network vibes. That old cut your break line type of vibe. That old serial killer type of vibe. That's all she giving. Bruh, she ain't even she about the she, <laughs> I already can smell what she cooking. She about to turn up. Watch. Let's see. Boom, <laughs> Jeffrey always for the nonsense. She always for the nonsense. And she basically giving us our sentiment. Like, we are her in that moment saying, get the popcorn ready. Get the popcorn ready because the next episode should be drama and entertainment. Drama and entertainment. Not the adult drama that we was getting, you know, the last, I don't even know how many episodes, but some kid teen drama. And I'm kind of here for it. And then, you know, he says, what well, we all been saying, Spencer, this is the first time I think he brought up. No, no, no. He brought up Coop in the last episode. But um, this is the first time I seen him talking to someone outside of his his house bubble, his mama Grace safe bubble, like letting Jordan know that those two ain't friends. And I don't get it. I don't get how Spencer can allow live to do stupid stuff like you know crash into parked cars and try to get him to switch and do all this nonsense yet he always run back to her and i don't get how coop on the other hand apologized to mo and everything yet they can't seem to apologize or talk to one another that's stupid to me it's dumb and it don't make no sense because how long they've been friends how long they not friend family. Like, look at that. Look how he was acting the last episode. Look how she was acting the last episode over a list over her birthday. And you telling me y'all can't have one conversation. Coop then sent you videos of why you start playing football in the first place. Your inspiration, all that good stuff looking out for her. You didn't send her a gift and set up her party. She didn't show up to Mama Grace's little graduation party. All that nonsense. Y'all had Tamika thing giving looks and all this stupid stuff. Yet, y'all haven't talked to each other yet. 
do better. Instead of focusing on Liv and Layla's failed, fake, little toxic relationship, we should have been nurturing this right here because let's be real, this is the relationship that pretty much got us all into the show. How real and how authentic it was between those two in season one and season two. I think this fakeness then went on too far, but let's go. Let's continue. Is she looking at Carrie, though? Hold on. Let me go back. Let's go back. I think that is Carrie. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Carrie, boy. <laughs> Like I said on my Instagram, hop on my Instagram to talk uh, more All-American or just talk period. But like I said, like, yo, ever since she showed up, she's been giving me them crazy vibes. And she already didn't say Liv and Layla's relationship is toxic. She already didn't plant the seeds to push them even further away. Not like they were that close anyway. Yet, <laughs> here she go. Yet again. Yet again. Liv giving that face like, bro, like, what you want? What you want? And then we got Layla. Look at her. I don't know if that is her. Hold on. She in purple. She in like purplish. Let me go back. Okay. Yeah, that ain't her. All right. Uh, I don't know if Layla is doing that look because of Spencer. Because, you know, Spencer is there. And this is going to be their first interaction since she went off on him. And, uh, you know... <laughs> I bet you she got a lot to say since so she didn't get an invite to the party. That was still dirty, too. I don't know if it's just me, but I thought Spencer at least sent out an invitation, even if she wasn't going to accept, you know, since he got lid prancing around everywhere. But I digress. It's either that or her and Olivia. But I think it's probably seeing Spencer, to be honest. And then, you know, patience coming through with the, I seem like, y'all seem like, y'all got patience right. Like, it seemed like the characters this season was vastly different, but patience still seems like patience from season, uh, was she in season one? Yeah, <laughs> from season one to season two. So, I like it because she the one telling Coop, like, yo, one more thing you got, one more thing you running away from, and that is Spencer. That is your family. Stop playing. And you know, Coop all oh, look at her appearing doing the same face. Same face. I'm not running for Spencer. Then why are you up there by yourself? Looking out the window, probably outside peering over there to him. Like, cut it out. Cut it out. Cut it out, man. So next episode is pretty much seeming like it's just gonna be nothing but they probably gonna start it off nice, probably within the first 20, 15 to 20 minutes, where it's being set up. Um Patients inviting people, people kind of concerned. You'll probably have a conversation with Jordan and Spencer. You'll probably have a conversation with Coop somewhere. You'll probably have a conversation with Liv talking about the whole Layla, Carrie thing. We're probably going to have a group of different conversations before they actually come together. And then we're going to get <laughs> the giving <laughs> of the friends. So. I'm excited for it. I ain't excited as much as I am about Homecoming. That's the episode I want to see. But this will be a nice break from all the adult drama. Like last episode, we got the, the adults letting down their hair. We got the kids, you know, being cool. Kind of like a One Tree Hill thing. Like you use like a filler episode with comedy just to show like the actors range and everything. And people just having fun. Just a lighthearted episode. So we're going to go into this one and, get you know, sprinkle some drama in that. Sprinkle some drama all up in that. And I'm here for it. I'm here for it. And then we'll ship off to homecoming where they're gonna press the remainder of the storyline and i think that is the episode i think that's the key episode probably that one and the remaining episodes in the season so um i'm excited i'm excited not over the over the top but i'm excited what y'all think about the promo are y'all excited about it do y'all think carrie is about to <laughs> set that place ablaze do y'all think they need to stop focusing on live and Layla so much and actually put that focus on people we want to see together like Coop, Spencer, Spencer, Liv, like <laughs> something, 
something. How do y'all feel about it? How do y'all think this episode is going to go down? Let me know. Give me y'all play by play. And then give me y'all pre-predictions as far as who you think I'm going to put on my good, my bad, my downright disrespectful list. And who do you think you're going to put just off the promo alone? on your good, bad, and downright disrespectful list. Let me know all that in the comments below, and I can't wait to see y'all in the episode. If y'all haven't seen the um, episode 14, 15 recap, then go ahead, check that out. I had a lot to say. And if you haven't seen the channel update, showing where I've been and what we're gonna be doing moving forth on the channel, then also check that out, all right? And until then, we'll see y'all in the next video. We out, peace.